So hey guys, if you didn't know or you do know, I went to GG Fest Houston over the weekend and I'm sorry I like a crazy rant. But yes, I went to Digi Fest Houston over the weekend and I had skip the line GA and I had the best time of my life. Let me first just starting off, I snuck into VIP. Okay. So I'm just going to show you what I got and tell you about it, how it was. I'm going to show you a couple pictures and videos, and yeah. So I got this bandana. It's like it has the Digi logo, and then it says Digi, like, around it. And then um, a Nash Greer t-shirt. has just says logo right here. And it says Greer 97 on the back. And then just the Digi shirt. It's just the Digi logo with the Digi. It says Digi. And then it says Digi Fest on the back with 2015 with the tour date. So I'm filming this on the 6th. Digi was yesterday the 5th. So they're in Dallas right now. So yes. Um, I got my phone case autographed from Baby Oreo, Mr. Cashier, and Artie. So... Yeah, it kind of came off though, but that's okay because I have a picture of it. And then I bought this Rudu Crew bracelet, but I bought two of these. Um, and then my mom actually caught this bracelet that says Brett Zach Zebras from Nick Bean when he was throwing them out off stage. And I'll tell you, well, she caught two of them, and I'll tell you about the one after this. And then here's my badge. It just says skip the line and yeah, it's a pretty bracelet. But I was so excited about this. I was like, oh my god, we're getting the badge, we're getting the badge. Because I've always wanted to have one of these badges. Like, you don't even get it. I've always wanted to have one. Like, I mean, who doesn't want to have one of these? Look how freaking cool you look. Like, oh, I'm cooler than you. I have a freaking badge. Okay, like, look how cool you look. I just, just look how cool you look. Who wouldn't want to have a badge? And then our tickets were right here. And so, let's get into this. Um, I'm going to start by there's something in there. Um, so, like, after we got, so we got there about 11.30. Uh, no, we got there about 11, and we did valet parking. And then, so, like, we had to wait, and we get in at 11.30 for skip the line. So, we waited in line for about 30 minutes, and then we finally get in there, and my mom's like, okay, we're going to buy t-shirts right away so they don't sell out of our sizes. Um, so, we did that, and she stood in line, we told, she's like, oh, go in there so, so you can get up close. She's like, okay, yeah, we'll do that. And, um, so after she got her shirts, we were, like, in there, and, like, there's this, like, little box thing, and so... We were, like, in the box, and, like, it was, and then, like, after my mom got the shirts, she was, like, texting, was, like, oh, my gosh, only VIP gold and silver are supposed to be in there, and so we were skipped the line, so we were skipped the line, and we were not supposed to be in there, so, basically, I just snuck in there, because, like, at the time we went in, there was no security at the door yet, so I just snuck in there, and it was me and my friend. And it was so fun. We were like fourth from being in the front row. It was just amazing. I don't know. Let me just say amazing. It was the best night of my life. So first, it's the little three boys that are friends that went. Um, I don't know their names. I forgot. Um, but then Maddie Wellborn came out and um announced Five Claude, and I was literally like dying. I was like, oh my god, Five Claude is coming out, and I was like dying. I'll show you the video. Um. I'll show you all the videos, actually. Um, should I show you the videos now, or wait till after? Hold up. I'm going to see if I can find it right now. I'm so unorganized, I'm sorry. So here's Maddie. She came out and announced them. And then, that's them coming out. So I was like dying by then, and then, so like I was jumping up and down the whole time, going crazy, 
and then I'll show you like the rest of the stuff they did at the, towards the end of the video. So just wait and so after that, I was like after their performance, I was like, oh, I'm starting to feel a little woozy and sick. Like mind you, before we got there, we had like a continental breakfast at our hotel, but they only had like they had no bacon, no eggs, no waffles, no pancakes, nothing. It was a bagel, the small box of cereal that are like this big, and like a small pair of fart parfait with like three pieces of granola and two strawberries and like this much yogurt it's so i was like didn't even really eat that much i didn't really drink water before but like when we were waiting up there like mind you we got into like the little vip box that we snuck into at 11 30 and the show started at two so we were already waiting in there for two hours and then the show comes on at 2, and we were like, I was dancing with the first people, then dancing right after that for 5 card, and I was literally dead by the end of that, and I was like, oh, I'm starting to feel woozy, and I was like, okay, no, Trina, you gotta make it through this, you have to wait for Jack and Jack's performance to be right here, and I was like, oh my god, and I was texting my mom, texting my mom, where are you, I feel like I'm gonna die, I feel like I'm sick, I'm overheating, I'm so claustrophobic, I'm dying, it's like, she never answered, so then I like, I was like, okay, Brianna, I have to get out of here. So then she was like, I was like, do you want to come with me? Um, I don't think you want to come with me, so I'm just going to go. So I ran out there, and I was like, looking everywhere, smoking section, over here, over here. And then I was like, had to wait in this long line to ask this lady where the parents are going. It was like, down, underground, three flights of stairs down. And that's so I finally found my mom, and I was like, mom, mom, she said, and like, when I got to my mom, she was like, terrified. She's like, oh my god, what's wrong with you? I was like, oh my god. I was, like, pale white, I was, like, crying, and then, uh, then she's like, okay, come on, we gotta go up the stairs, we gotta go up the stairs to get some food or something, and she's like, she just got me two slider hamburgers and, um, two waters, I drank them and ate that so fast, and then I rest there for a second, and then, I, like, 5% on my phone by the time of that, I was like, okay, we gotta charge my phone, we gotta charge my phone, and then, here he comes, um, Daniel Sky pronounces Aaron Carpenter in um Ted's and I'm like, Oh my god, oh my god I think it's Tina Austin. I don't know. I was still dying at that point. And then so like there's like this like we were on the floor and then like there's this like balcony thing that's like above us and t Mr. Cashier Tay was up there and I have a video of her. I was like, Tay Tay and I was doing the heart like this with my phone in my hands, so I was doing the heart and um I was literally yelling, Tay, Tay. Do I have a video? Did I save the video? I don't think I saved it. Yeah, I didn't save the video, but I didn't even get a video of him doing the heart. But he he looked right at me, and I was yelling, Tay, like so loud, and he did the heart right back to me like this, and he was with James, and he was like doing the heart, and I was doing the heart. It was so great. I was like. Ah! Okay, and then after that, um, um, no, after that, Aaron and Tess came on, so I was like, we're on before, and so they came on, and I was like, videotaping them, and then I had them on there, and then I went to go turn my phone again, and then, uh, I tried to go back up there, just get my friend, and then I snuck in, the lady was like, um, I had my badge on, she looked at my badge, she's like, uh, you can't get in. I was like, man, I gotta get my friend the water. She has asthma. She's about to die. I have to go go, go in there and give her the water. And so she let me in there to go give me the water. And so I gave her the water. And then I was like standing up there for a second trying to ski. And I was standing up there. And then next thing you know, I start having a sweating. And I was like dying. I was like dying once again. And I was like, oh my god. No. No. So I had to go out again redo the whole thing where I was like dying how to drink more water it was horrible and then so after that my friend's like okay I'm getting sick of this I'm getting close to I feel like I'm dying so we all go out and then um we go down to the parent section no so we get out and we sit down at like the gate by the t-shirt thing and then like she goes and buys her Nashville t-shirt but the first thing when my mom bought the t-shirts she only bought us the Digi shirts, and then my friend wants to go buy her, um, Nash Gurria, um, t-shirt, and so she wants to go buy that, and it's like, okay, we're gonna go down to her lounge, I need to charge my phone, so then we were like, okay, so we charged my phone till it was, like, at 12%, and then, sorry if this is all over the place, I don't know, um, I'm sorry, um, but yeah, 
we thought it was October 2nd, and then we were like, okay, and so we went up the stairs, and like, right at, like, it's like up the stairs, and like, this little balcony, and like, the little walkway, and like, more stairs coming down from like, the highest level, so like, one, two, okay, so like, three floors, basically, so the third floor, there's stairs coming down, and it was like, Jonah and Grant were coming down, so we are like, okay, let's get out the Sharpie, get out the posters, and we had, like, our Sharpie posters and phone, then this girl behind us, she just starts running and running and running to, like, these bl big, huge black curtains, and she gets up there, and I'm like, oh, uh, let's go, I don't barely know who Jonah and Grant is, let's go, and so we ran over there, and guess who's out there, AJ, he is so cute he was such a good singer he like mixed all the newest songs 70s songs and let me try to find a picture of aj oh my god he's so cute it's hard for me to go from like through my camera roll click like this trying to find things okay so here's aj so he's there, and I'm, like, this girl's giving out pictures of, like, AJ for him to sign. I'm, like, AJ, AJ, with my, um, picture, my poster, and he signed it. And so I had a thing, um, for AJ to sign. And then, baby Ariel, um, came out, and she, I was, like, Ariel, Ariel, um, Ariel. I get so confused, I don't know why. It's like, get, I gave her my phone, and she was, like, signed it, and it was so cute. And it was just such a great time. And she signed it. And then Artie came out. And she was like, and then she's like, oh, okay. And like, everyone said, I was like, okay, can you sign my phone, please? And then, so she did that. And I was still trying to, my friend was still trying to get AJ to sign her thing. So I was over there with AJ. And then Tay walks out of the curtain. And Tay comes over. And Tay's just standing there like this. Like, not, like he's not going to meet anyone. No one knows him right there. I'm like, Tay! Tay! And then, I give him, I'm like, say, 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 so, like, I have, like, right in my face, like, this close, like, because that's the only way you're going to get him to sign something, it's, like, right by here, like, so I was like, say, 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 and he signed it, Mr. Cashier, if you can barely see that, I'm pulling up a picture right now, of my phone, here are the signatures, Mr. Cashier, are you know, all right, so those are the signatures, and, and it, it was crazy. It was so good. Um, so after that, um, we were, like, gonna try to go find my mom after, like, they all went back in. And my mom was, like, my, I was, like, yelling, like, trying to find my mom, trying to find my mom. I couldn't find her. And she was, like, with these girls, and this girl was crying. I was, like, Mom, what are you doing? It's like, oh, my God, Five Squad was right there. They wanted to be on his section. She, they were right there. They were right there. And I was, like, why didn't you tell me? Oh, my God, I caught him at Five Squad. What is wrong with you? But then, I was like so mad. I was like, oh my god, oh my god. Oh, but I did not get to meet Five Quad, and I was just like, why wouldn't you call me? I was like getting so mad at my mom. And then later, after I was like crying and like going crazy, no. Okay, let's go back to Ariel. And after Chase, I'm my thing. I got a picture with Ariel. Let me find it. Hold on. It's not going to be painted right here because it's also my profile picture on Instagram. And so I got a picture with her. And, like in the, and then I had the bracelets on my badge. Hold up. Yeah. So you can see I had the bracelets just hanging on my badge like that. And I guess when I was meeting... Ariel, my, my bracelets came off of my badge, and then, so I ran up to my mom crying, mom, I lost my bracelet, <laughs> my sister Nick gave me, I lost my little bracelet, and so, I was like, devastated, because I lost a bracelet, and then I was like, okay, well, Bree's wearing hers, I'm sure she'll give you your Brad Zach one, I'm sure she will, and then, so I bought another Rudy one, and then, I, and my friends, I love you, Bree, I love you, and she gave me her bracelet, and I was like, oh my god, and then she told me about five quad, and I was like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, so, yes, here's Edwin taking pictures with girls, here's more Edwin, here's Timmy, 
Watch. Hit me again. Add one again. Hold up. Where are my pictures? Hold up. I'm missing pictures here. Hold up. Okay, well, I have to go find more pictures for my mom. Okay. Let's see here. Okay, I'm trying to find, okay, yes, okay, so where did I leave off? So there's a couple of videos here. There's Kenny. Edwin trying to kiss a girl. Um, Edwin again. Okay. Then there's Nick. So Nick's right there. She's the, she only knows Nick. Nick's the only one she knows. And that's the only ones I can find. That's weird. I could have sworn. Okay, well, I don't know, but there was one of Nick, um, like, kissing a girl, that was, like, really weird. But, yes. So, then there was that one, and then, so, after that, I was, like, freaking out, and then she told me they were only in the VIP lounge meeting people. I was, like, okay. So, then, after that, um, Aaron Carpenter, no. Yes. So, this is when Nash, we were, like, waiting in line, and Nash came out, I was, like, running. And then, Nash came to announce someone. So Nash came out to do that. And then, yes. So I might have to make this video into two parts. I'm sorry, it's getting so long. So, I'm going to make this video into two parts. Go watch part two. Um, yeah, I'll probably link it. And, yeah. Okay, I'm going to go do that. Um, I'm going to film this video, so I'll be looking at it. And, yeah, bye.